the battleground state, there's a chance the election could hinge on Milwaukee County. 12 News' Nick Bohr investigates the extra measures the sheriff's office is taking to ensure votes are counted in a secure and safe place. We want to ensure that we don't have too many people, so we will be counting. With all the votes in Milwaukee County being tabulated at the courthouse on election night, there is concern it will be a focal point of any displeasure with the results or the process. There's a lot of, a lot of passionate people about politics and about this election specifically. I, I don't know that it was that way 20 years ago, but people are more passionate than ever about politics and specifically the presidential election. And for that reason, we want to make sure that, that we're taking the appropriate precautions. Inspector Aaron Dobson is overseeing security at the courthouse complex. So everyone's going to enter this way and we're going to turn our screening equipment around and then head into the cafeteria in that direction. The cafeteria will be converted to the public viewing area to watch as the totals come in and are updated. We are planning on there being a lot of attention and people coming to watch what the election workers are doing. Does that national attention inherently create risk? Oh, absolutely. It creates risk. It creates an intense focus on us and what we're doing. So we want to ensure that everyone is safe and secure, and that's why we're creating plans. That includes sharing intelligence from state and federal agencies, monitoring social media, and having extra deputies on hand election night. We're considering all the possibilities of, of what could happen, and we're hopeful that it doesn't, and that's why we're making plans now to ensure that it doesn't. Nick joins us live now, and Nick, the security includes shutting down the streets in front of the courthouse. Right, Chris, and this is the first time they'll be doing that. They'll be shutting down 10th Street here. This is on the west side of the courthouse. It'll be shut down, barricaded once the polls close. That's to allow the municipal clerks to bring those election results here in person with police escorts in some cases inside this only door here that will be open that night. And they'll be doing uh, that tabulation right inside the, this uh, wall right here where the cafeteria is. And because of the high turnout that they are expecting that day, they expect to have a late night here, Kristen. All right, Nick Bohr live at the Milwaukee County Courthouse tonight.